Well, Defense Force officers say they're witnessing a steady flow of migrants to our shores. Smugglers are becoming more creative, switching to faster boats to get into our country. Commodore of the Royal Bahamas Defense Force, Telus Bethel, says the Defense Force is on high alert. He says officers are ready to respond and will continue to patrol the southern Bahamas, particularly in the wake of several significant migrant apprehensions at the start of the year. Now, on the issue of illegal poaching, Bethel says it has been a challenge over the years, but signaled that progress is being made. The Defense Force has made some significant inroads with respect to the, the poaching situation. Um, of course, it was several months ago we apprehended uh, at one time three steel-hulled uh, vessels. And altogether for the year 20, 2018, we apprehended over uh, approximately 197 uh, Dominican poachers uh, with fines totaling up to $8 million. And uh, some reports that we're getting from the local fishing community is that there seems to have been no interference with the, by the Dominicans, but we also know that they have also shifted their means of poaching, you know. And this is, when you make an inroad in one area, you have success in other areas, you have to always be mindful it's not over because people are always thinking what to do next. Well, Commodore Bethel says efforts are being made to not only counteract poachers' operations, but to take a more collaborative approach to addressing the issue. What we are doing is we are, we are networking with, with all of our local partner agencies, with its immigration, as well as our regional partners, um, whether it's the Coast Guard, the Turks and Caicos. Um, and, and so this, this communication is really helping to feed information because you can appreciate it, the, the vast maritime domain that the Bahamas has. It's like if you don't have these eyes and ears, it's like searching for a needle in a haystack. And certainly that has been improving the way we do business.